Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Meghnad. In this module, we will learn how to create lists in HTML. So let's get started. Now, what exactly is list is? Let's take for example, let's go to Word document. And here I have some of the states in India. So I kept some four states. In Word document, normally we can create using bullet lists or numbers, we can display this list, right? So now if I put this here, so you can see this is uh, bulleted lists. And also I can change it to something like uh, here, I can change it to some disk here, or circle bullet, or I can change it to, uh, even I can change it to square. Or even I can do uh, numbers as well here. You can see this is an ordered list where we have a uh, numbering order. I mean, ABCD order. And I want to change it to Roman letters. I can change it. I want to change it to um, numbering order. I can change it. So this is a ordered list. Now, similarly, we can also do in HTML. So let's get started. Now, what I'll do is, I'll just remove this order. So I want to see this in ordered or unordered list in HTML and see how it looks like in the browser, right? So what I'll do is I'll copy this and I'll open Visual Studio Code and file new file and I will save it, file save. And in the same folder, I'll save it as HTML files and I will save it as list example, lists example. And now as usual, I'll put here HTML, a root tag and head tag. And then I'll be adding a body tag. Now here I pasted the content that I copied from the Word document. Now this, I want to have some heading. I want to have some small heading. So I'll put here H3. We have learned it in the previous module. And I'll do this control X and here control V. So I just pasted this. Now when I see this in the browser, so let me go back to this and right click on this list example and open with Google Chrome. Now you can see here, this is not in any order. It's displaying in the same line. So I want to display in orders in, in uh, bullet formats. Now in HTML, we have ordered list and unordered list. Unordered list is like bullets. Now bulleted list, now what I have to do is I have to go to this and for ordered list, you have to put or unordered list, you have to put UL. UL stands for unordered list and let me close it. Now for each item, this is called list item. This is a list item. This is a list item. So for each list item, we have to put inside an LI tag. So now what I'll do is I'll just put here LI that's called list item. So we have four list items here. So I'll just copy this, control C, and one, two, three, four. Now I'll just paste this. I'll just do control X and paste between this and here. I'll do control X, paste it, and control X, and control V, and control X, control V. Now what I have done here is I just copied and had this now inside. So UL stands for unordered list, and LI stands for list item. So we have four list items now. Let's see what's the default order that we see in browser. So let's go to the browser and refresh it. Now you can see here by default, I'm seeing this as the type as disk. Now I want to change it. Um, I want to see the circle here. So the default is the type is DISC. So this is a disk that you're seeing here. So that's the default format. Now I want to, now if I refresh it, it's same. Now I want to see here circle. Now if I save it and if I go back, you can see here it just got changed. The bullets are looking like circles now. Now I want to change it square. So I can just change it to here, S-Q-U-A-R square. So now you'll see the bullets in the form of square. So whatever you have seen now, this is called unordered list because we are following bulleted list. And now we can see ordered list. So for ordered list, we'll be putting here O-E-L. O-E-L stands for ordered list. Now let me remove this type. I'm just putting here OL. Let's see what's the default order for OL. So I'll change this closing tag to OL. Now let's see. So OL stands for ordered list. Now let me refresh it. Now you can see here one, two, three, four. So that's the default order. Now you can even put your type is equal to one. So I'll put your type is equal to, you can see the possible options here. One, if you give type equal to one, if you give one, two, three, four. A, if you give capital ABCD, small ABCD order. And uh, I stands for Roman letters, capital Roman letters, and lowercase Roman letters. Now let's see this now very quickly. So I'll just put here one. Let's save it. 
Let's go back and refresh it. You can see 134. I'll just change it to, and I'll just put here capital A. And now let's save it. Let's go back and refresh it. You can see A, B, C, D. Now I'll change it to small a. And now let's save it and go back. And you can see here small a, B, C, D. Then I'll put it small i or capital I. Now you'll see here capital Roman letters. Now I want to put it here in lowercase Roman, Roman letters. I'll put here small i and save it. Let's go back and refresh it. You can see one, two, three, four. So this is called ordered list. Now I hope you are clear with how to create ordered list using OL and the default order is one, two, three, four. Unordered list using UL and the default order is a disk order, right? So I hope you are clear with this concepts of list, how to create list order and unordered list. Thank you for watching. See you in the next module.